Mario's distress signal. From his transmitter? Not just another camera. This is the transmission of distress adhered to Octo's robot body. It cannot be far. With the source of the distress signal on my map, please, Art. Where are you, Octo? <clears throat> Man, he's gone really deep. The biomass keeps going up. When's it going to stop? 360, 70, 80, 90, 400 Gs. It Okay, 450. So I'm almost at biomass 2. Well, that looks like a fun place. I think I'll get out of there. These could use some watering. I want to take a look around the place first, though. Jesus. Okay, so I need to water these to be able to go further down because there's nowhere else I can go. Alright, what's down here? more of these things. God, so many of them. Oh, do you know what I need? Compost. Oh, and what do you know? They've provided me with compost. Damn it! I'm gonna wait right down here. Come on. There. This will definitely be my compost chamber. Okay, five composts. Now, can I compost two at a time? I should be able to. What about these? These are a little bit more spread out. Nope, still can. Alright, let me grab some more compost. As always, compost is always useful. Here, have an explosion. Oh, crap! It actually kills them? I, I'd never noticed that before, okay? Whoops. That's alright, I still have two.
Okay, Max. <clears throat> and still plenty of fighter left. Though it wouldn't hurt to have a couple more. Oh my god, look at all these seeds. What if I did this? Well, that was useless. Oh, hello! It just so happens I need you. I can't remember for what at this point, but I know I need you for something. Okay, these have to stay as a farm, right? Please tell me they can stay. Yeah, I think they can stay. Research updated? What? What exactly did I learn? Was this right? Oh, so I can burst a hydron seed on them and convert them. Good to know. All righty. Need some more. Ouch. Make two for every two that I take. That should be sustainable. Okay, four should be good enough. At least to get me to buy a mass three. Wait a minute, what if, is there something else I can... Do I have any of these that I can... Compost? No, not these, but these I think I can, right? Yeah. Let me grab some more. They're always useful.
this should max me out. Yep. Uh, fine, I'll stick with four. God damn it. Where does this go? <clears throat> oh, can't go there yet. Ooh, what's over here? Wait, so how do I continue? Do I need to destroy these? I think I do. I need to destroy one group of the spores. Damn, I wanted un an unlimited farm. Oh, is this thing about to die? Yeah. Hmm. Well, I guess I'll just get to it. So a Hydron Seed does what? It destroys them. So I can use this to clean out spores. That's good to know. Should do it. Yep. Okay, so I can go to the right. Does this allow me to go down yet? Yeah, I can go down and to the right. Oh, let's head to the right. What's the point of this area up here? Hello? Let me guess. Places to plant up here? There should be. I see what you're doing, game. I should do it. Perfect. Dodge that one like a pro. Okay, now can I get this one to go down? I really want to know if you can do that. Down, down, down. Come on, it's like soccer. No. Close, close. No, no. Oh my god. This one's a lost cause. Yeah, go in there. <laughs> Alright, let's see what's going up. Let's see what's going on up here. We got one. Just gotta water this, and then they should spread. I didn't exactly want it to go that far. Come on, come on back. Oh, 
Oh yeah, I can enrich these. Hey, I wonder if I can enrich three at one time. Nope. Just two. Okay, so this should almost be enough. Yeah, I need to enrich them. Whoa, that was close. Oh, but you know, I could also just plant one down here. Yeah, that'll be enough. I think. Oh, I need five more, damn it. Can I water something? I don't think so. No, I need some compost. I'm getting to be a pro at jetpacking. Ooh, that was close. Egg sack almost killed my uh, compost again. <laughs> I don't need to do anything for this one to uh, activate again. And bloop. No? There we go. Oh, I actually got to the max just from these things multiplying? Huh. Well, I'll grab some more compost, nonetheless. Okay. I'm still gonna compost something, just to keep it at max, because it's gone down now that I've killed some of the Fida. Is that a seed stuck? What is it doing up there? Okay. <laughs> it's stuck in the magma hole. Uh, so what happens if I water these? Ah. I could actually use some more, so I'm going to do that. Compost. Just gonna compost one thing. Let's do. Oh, I guess two things. Let's do both of you. 35. This should keep me at max. Now let's go down. This place didn't have a harvester, did it? I'm not sure.
Okay, what do we got here? We have shit tons of danger. That's what we've got. I think I'm going to have to make this an explosion room. Well, this can obviously be blown apart. Magma. And, oh, there's a harvester. Yeah, this place is just asking for explosions everywhere. There's really nothing else I can plant. What do you know, spores? Hmm, if these spores make it outside... Well... I wonder if they could even really get out here. I mean, obviously they can, but I wonder if it's likely. They're moderately well contained. <clears throat> what the hell just happened? Oh, okay, so they act just the same as those, uh, those sticky things on the ceiling. They consume an explosive seed, they die. Oh, hello. Oh, crap, that thing's gonna die. Why? Goodbye. It's alright, I don't need them. Ow, jeez. That's a lot of force. So I've unlocked that. <clears throat> oh yeah, here. I need spores. Oh, I can enrich these, can't I? I don't want to. Grab some spores. Three spores, right? Yeah, will that be enough? Are they gonna make any more? Nope, that's it.
is an extraordinarily dangerous place for these psychots. Everything explodes. Just thinking, what if I planted a prac seed here? Would it live? Depends on whether the magma comes out randomly or at a specific spot. It seems to only be dripping from there, so you know what? I'm gonna do it. Why not? It should survive. And it gives me more than the explosion ones. Plus 30 or 40? Hmm. Plus 40. Oh yeah, and I can go down there. I want to find the nests of those things. Where did they go? The Psychots. I didn't even realize this was here. <laughs> it's already planted. Uh, maybe the Psychot nest is down. From the nest? Oh, they took it. This is not Octo. It is his transmitter only. Oh. It must have become detached. It is 72.405% likely this transmitter was confounded with a protopath by Psychot Autobiots. Scanning. This transmitter experienced a distress of deactivation approximately 24.57 minutes after the commencement of Octo's mission. Hardware failure. That explains why Octo stopped transmitting, and why he left behind a trail of camera modules. He hoped to maintain contact with the surface. Now we may never find him. Please do not be wary. It is 89.45% likely that Octo is in distress, very nearby. I have detected electronic inactivity below us. And now they're gonna freak out and try to kill me. Oh my god. Here, take my seeds. Well, that should <clears throat> allow them to make one more. There's quite a bit I can plant here. There's a lot I could plant here. Okay, so these should be safe from explosions. So let's do this. I'm gonna compost. Uh oh, one just died. Another is gonna die, damn it. You know what? If you're gonna be like that, I'm gonna give you a nice little seed. You're gonna like this one, it's tasty. Come on, open up. You're gonna love it. There you go. Here. It's spicy. Goodbye.
And these should also be safe. This one as well, yeah. Did I make a mistake with all the stuff I planted up there? I think I did. Yeah, these seeds are gonna go up. And... Will they stick here? Hmm. I think I gotta blow it all up. I don't know if they're actually going to stick here. Well, I can change that pretty easily. Let's see what happens. Be careful, don't get hit by the magma. Didn't want to hit the seed. Didn't want to throw that. I could always replant that stuff really easily, so let me go grab some more explosions. Ow. Okay. Oh, I heard one growing. There you go. Come on, come on to the site. Yes! Now, what do these give me? Plus... Plus 40? Plus 50? Okay, that's definitely more. Uh, there's no way this one's going to get planted. So, I'm going to put that back. Here you go. Uh, I guess I'll put that one back. It's down here. Oh. Almost at biomass four. I just need one more anything. Here, let's get them to make another one. Another psychot. Find out what's down here. Okay, I'm back. You didn't even know I had left, did you?
This is a very dangerous cavern. Yeah, not going in there. Oh, what's this? Is this Octo? Greetings, Dr. Keith. Art has updated me on the status of your mission. I am sorry to hear of your predicament, and I thank you for risking so much to locate me. It is unfortunate that my robotic body is no longer functional, but hopefully you will find the data I have collected to be of use. Dr. Ronga in particular, I believe, will benefit from it. Hello, Octo. It seems this is your final resting place. Tell me, what brought you to the lowest depths of Left Cap? I must correct you, Dr. Key. There are kilometers of tunnels below us, but they are too cramped and inhospitable for human presence. I ventured deep into those tunnels following my mission program. I was successful in discovering the source of the magma which is pumped through Left Cavern by the Ferenlaxes. I now pass this data on to you, along with several unexpected findings I obtained while pursuing that objective. Unfortunately, I was heavily damaged in those depths. I was nearly able to emerge until I became trapped in this magma flow. What irony. Thank you for your valorous service, Octo. I assure you, Armani will receive this. Can you please tell me more about the unexpected data you collected? Regretfully, I lack the capacity to speculate which of it will be of most interest to a human mind. I suggest you ask Art, as he is my intellectual superior by several orders of magnitude. Alert! This unknown object contains eight of Octo's appendages. Other than those five appendages that have achieved involuntary dispossession. <laughs> Good news! Despite dispossessed appendages, I have determined it is 16.3% likely that this can be classified as Octo. Yeah. But this is a surprise. <laughs> you clearly seem to be experiencing some operational difficulty with regard to human communication. Art's current speech patterns are due to a practical joke. Just prior to launch, his natural language module was reverted to a much earlier version. If you check the build number, you'll find it dates back to the 40s. Huh. Perhaps it wasn't clear that a fix could not be uploaded after the vessel cleared over. In any case, the rest of his computational capacity is unaffected. Although I can't understand human, I hope you have enjoyed this joke. Hmm. Octo, it is time for us to go. Of course. I wish you the best of luck. Attention! I am able to download the entirety of Octo's current operational state into my data storage. That would be most welcome. Yes, very good. Thank you for doing that, Art. Amani will be pleased. Congratulations! I have also finished processing the downloaded jet transcript. Are you saying that you have a new program for my jetpack? Yes! This script was downloaded from Octo's memory banks. It is the ELS-X3 script that permits hovering. Excellent! Alert! You can switch between jetpack scripts in the menu. A hover would be very nice. Okay, scripts. That's one I already have, right? Yeah. Let's give it a shot. That is really nice. Might take some getting used to, though. But now I can do this. Hey, what's going on, Magmo? God. Oh god, uh, I need to heal now. One more hit and I think I'm dead. Um, where's the nearest heal a jig Should be right up here, yep. Ah, much better. Just put my toe into some magma, no big deal. 
So there's one spot I still haven't checked. Where is it? Whoops. Uh, uh, I didn't mean to do that. Well, it's not here. Wow. I have exactly the same health as I did before. Nice. Maybe I've checked everything. Yeah, I guess I've checked everything. Um, I am done here. So what is it? What is the information that Octo wanted me to have? Because I don't see anything new. Maybe I've already discovered it all. Hmm. Well, let's go back up here, and I'm going to not only heal, but especially collect stuff. I want to replenish my supplies. Look at all those seeds. Grab some compost, and then I should be out of here. Uh, where's the compost at? I think I took a wrong turn. Where do I go? No, no. It's too far in. Whoops, I just threw an explosive. Is it up here and to the right? Yeah, here it is. I'll go for one more batch. Yeah. Get up to four composts. Why did it just disappear? There's not very many of these left. I feel like they just die when I'm not here. I don't know if the game actually runs simulations and the plant life... Or not the plant life, just the life. The life forms kind of run through their lives even when I'm not here. I don't know. Okay, well, I'm refreshed on supplies, so what do I need to do? That's done. What are my objectives? Alright, so I've got the helm thing and get to base camp. And I could always use more power. Now, where had I not done? <clears throat> I know there. I think it's this and this. So, what did I need to do here? I think I was going to kill this thing. Oh, see, but... Ow. 
But Prax will die from explosions, right? Yeah, they don't take it well. Did I ever plant anything here? Okay, so how the hell do I get to buy them? Isn't it supposed to take damage? Aren't these things supposed to take extreme heat? Why does it keep dying? I don't get it. Okay, well I can do this. I think that will get me to biomass... 4? If it lives long enough, please don't die before it comes out. So it is possible. Okay, okay. I better do this fast. Don't attack me. And then convert it back. Okay, here we go. This will do it. Come on, come on. There we go. Now let's leave before one of them dies. So I've got 68 power. Okay, Leth Gorge. I think that's the last place of the places I've already been that does not have max power. And I think it has a harvester, doesn't it? anything up here? Nope. Okay. So what would be the ideal thing to put here? I have no Fida and no Psychots. Well, first thing I'm going to do is get rid of these damn spores. I'm back here. Okay. Spores, whoa. <laughs> Spores are 100% gone. Actually, I could use some more explosive balls. Okay. Uh, so what should I make? These are worth... 30. Mm, it's not too much. I know that the fertilized or composted... Helids are worth 40, right? Yeah. That would be quite a bit more. These aren't worth jack shit, so useless, don't have those. Those are worth 40. So that will be just as good as the other stuff. Except that... Uh, uh, stretch. Oh, it feels good. So, mm, the Prax will give me just as much biomass as the Halids, but seeds will be much harder to get for them, so that's not worth it. Can't plant that, can't plant that. Well, now I know. It's gotta be the Halids. So I've gotta convert everything, make it a Halid, and then compost it all. 
This is going to take a while. Oh. Let's get to it. Alright. Gotta go get more supplies. <laughs> and I'm not going to bother planting anything until I've gotten rid of all the explosion plants, because then they will just blow up what I plant. So I need more of those, and I can get them... here... Yep. Right? I think I can get them here. Now I can get the yellow ones, and I can convert yellow ones to... I can convert the acidic ones to non-acidic alkaline by using water. Man, that only gives me three. I saw a bunch of the other kinds somewhere, but I don't remember where. Where were they? I don't remember. They were... okay, they were... Nope. They were here, weren't they? I think they were here. Yeah. Yep. They were right over here. Okay, that might be enough. What does this say I have 11 seeds? I can't hold 11, can I? I didn't think so. How the heck did I end up with 11 seeds? Okay, and now I can take these. Gotta be careful with this. What the? What? Okay, that did not go to plan. Actually, we'll take your spores, though. Is that it? Just two? I should probably do it that way, actually. The only thing I lose are explosion seeds, which I don't need more of. This hover is really nice. No more? Okay, time to start planting halids. Yep, I have zero biomass. Whoops. No, oh, come back.
There's my 11th seed. <laughs> Still don't know how that happened. Okay, I should have some more seeds waiting for me down at the bottom. Because I think I have two that are watered, yeah. So I should have one more seed waiting for me. Okay, is that it? Yep, that's all I can plant. Time to fertilize. Most of these I can only get one at a time, I think. Let's see, these might be too far apart. Ah, phew, they're not. Alright, so I've done all the ones on the right side. I'm gonna have so many seeds down here. Okay, all the ones on the right side are done. Time to go collect some more compost and get the ones on the left side. Back to good old enrichment. AKA my farming factory where I can get almost everything I need. Where did they all go? Oh my god, that's all of them. What the? What in the hell is going on? Why can't I make more? Do I have too much biomass? see what happens with that one I just made. Let's see if that turns into a baby. Okay, maybe there's just too much biomass. So I need to kill something. Because I need more of these. If these die, I am screwed. I'm gonna go kill something. There, minus 40. I can make eight new ones. God, there's only going to be three alive. More, more. Okay, max compost and a very good population of those things. Just gonna grab some more seeds. Actually, I don't need to do that. There's shit tons of seeds in here. <clears throat> Hopefully this is enough. I can't think of anything I could do that could possibly produce more biomass than this.
Oh, sweet, I maxed it. Excellent. Okay, so that should be every single thing maxed, I think. At least, uh, of where I've been already. Yeah. Okay. 72 power. So let's go here. I need to go down to the right. Am I going the right way? I have no idea. I think I am. Warning! Scans indicate a proximity to the planetary surface. And we have attained significant depth in this cave. We may be approaching an exit, Hart. I think we are. Question is, should I go back and make a decision now, or should I wait? Because I still have no idea what each one's going to do. I'm going to wait for now. Oh, yes it is. What? No, 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 no way. That area is like totally not solid on the scanners. All kinds of little chambers and stuff. But they do not connect. I found no other passages in this way is blocked. Blocked by what? Maybe I can do something from here. Or maybe some of the base camp equipment. Um, I... I'm not close enough to the surface for you to help. But boulders blocking this tunnel appear to be weak. Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah, so great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, do you have a pry bar or something? I have something better. too large. I will need to destroy them with explosives. Explosives? Ugh, where are you gonna get explosives? This ecosystem has a... The Ferenzoa! Its seeds totally blow up. You can blast your way through those boulders. Get to it. We'll have a lot of exploding to do. Here we go. What the hell? What am I hitting? I hope that's all I need because now I'm out. Nope. Damn it. Okay, where will I find tons of explosives? Probably here.
Hold on just a second, be right back. Okay, I am back. Now, I'm wondering... What I'm wondering is, should I make a decision? Based on almost no information at all back at... the helm? Or... Should I go on to base camp? Can I go back here and make a decision? I just don't know. I'm gonna go forwards a little bit. Well, it sounds like that's the outside. The problem with the helm is that I don't actually know what I'm deciding. I have a guess, but it's just a guess. It's not based on anything concrete. Given what the two artifacts, or whatever they are, look like at the helm, and now I'm realizing also the fact that it's called the helm, makes me think that maybe this is some sort of a spaceship. One choice is to stay on Mars, and the other is to try to look for a new, more habitable planet, maybe? But I just don't know. Should I continue on? I mean, why wouldn't I be able to just come back? Um... Well, I'm gonna go forwards a bit, because... I'm thinking the game is probably going to give me a chance to do something before it makes me permanently unable to go back. That's my guess. Oh uh, yeah, you did it. Run for it and you'll make it back to base camp from there. Definitely. Maybe just a little frostbite is all. Okay, well, here we go. I really hope this doesn't screw me out of going back. Okay, well, I guess that's my cue. I am going back. To the helm. And if this thing goes out into space, then maybe I'll be on it. state. This required computer hardware. <laughs> Aw, thanks, Art. Thanks to both of you guys. Bummer about the robot, but at least the GSA didn't lose all of this data. Greetings, Dr. Ronga. We have not spoken in some time. As you can see, some of your changes to my programming produced unanticipated complications. However, they also led to the desired results as you'll observe in the data I collected. Nice! You found the magma source? I can't wait to dig through all of this. 
I'm sure I'll learn more about Lev Cavern, like how it came to support life in the first place. You guys rule. That was a very strange place for that audio to be triggered. Why did I have to come here for that to happen? Hello, sentient ball of spaghetti roots. Okay, so again, I'm thinking this... Uh, it shows one planet and stuff on a planet, I guess. And this shows... This monument is powered. If I wait there for a moment, the machine will activate one of its functions. <clears throat> And this shows what looks like three planets, or three balls of some sort anyway, and what looks to be some sort of spacecraft. So I'm thinking this is the one that launches the ship if there is actually a ship, and my guess is right, so I'm going with this one. Let's see what happens. I need to leave. Should I leave? Maybe I should stay. Well, but then I'd die, wouldn't I? Yeah, my suit would just run out. Oh, I cannot uh, open my map. So I need to actually go. Hey, it looks like my guest was right. It is leaving. Goodbye, sentience. Well, there you go. That was a strangely abrupt ending. But anyway, I really love this game. It's just... It had uh, a mixture of... Simply fun gameplay, just messing around with all the different life forms And their combinations. And it was constantly... A fascinating because there's always new life that was being introduced and new interactions that I was learning. I don't even think I quite learned everything about the life forms that I could. I think there were a couple missing things. So it's the constant fun core gameplay combined with the fascinating alien life that just kept getting revealed and revealed throughout the whole game that I just loved. It's just a really good game. I'm always terrible about summing up, I f at least I feel like I'm always terrible about summing up why I liked a game. I feel like I'm really good at saying why I don't like a game, but not very good at saying why I do. 
but I really like this game. Well, I'll let the outro play out, but I hope you have enjoyed my playthrough of Waking Mars. So, I completed the game 108.4%? I don't understand. How can I complete more of the game than exists? Well, I guess I was pretty damn thorough on my first playthrough. Anyway, goodbye.